With his approval rating now lower than ever, President Obama is trying to inject some new blood into his economic team. CBS News senior White House correspondent Bill Plant has the latest on that from the White House. Bill, good morning to you. Good morning to you, Jeff. The president nominated Alan Kruger to lead the White House Council of Economic Advisors. This comes as the president is working on new economic initiatives, which he will unveil next week in hopes to reverse his slumping poll numbers. We need folks in Washington to make decisions based on what's best for the country, not, what, not what's best uh, for any political party or special interests. But the sputtering economy continues to drag down the president's approval rating. The latest Gallup Daily tracking poll shows it to be at 38 percent, a record low. And the new Associated Press poll shows President Obama is faring poorly among key groups who helped elect him in 2008. Seven out of ten white independent voters say he doesn't deserve a second term. And only 50 percent of women believe he should be reelected. That's down from 68 percent recorded after Mr. Obama's first 100 days in office. Based Alan Kruger, the Princeton the economist whom the president has tapped to lead his economic team, spent two years at the Treasury Department where he worked on the popular Cash for Clunkers program. With 9.1 percent unemployment and a depressed housing market, Kruger will have a full plate if his nomination gets through the Senate. None of the leading Republican candidates who want President Obama's job address the Kruger nomination, but like Mitt Romney last week, they continue to hammer the president's economic record. And what I've seen and said from this president is not a triple A presidency, but I'll call it a triple D presidency. It's been a presidency which has been uh, associated with debt and with downgrade and with delay. In his Rose Garden announcement of the Kruger nomination, now, the president acknowledged the painfully slow pace the of the economic recovery. Our great ongoing challenge as a nation remains how to get this economy growing faster. Well, getting the economy growing faster will be the focus of the president's speech next week. He's considering tax cuts and tax credits to spur hiring as well as a new program to refinance homes. Jeff? Hey, Bill, has, so has the White House said how concerned they are about these numbers, the 38% uh, approval rating? Well, they don't tell us how concerned they are, but they're very concerned. And they're not so much concerned about today's numbers as about the downward trend. They know here that they've got very little time to reverse that. Jeff? Bill Plant at the White House. Bill, thank you.